today we're going to be talking about um, applying the mind emotion setup and how that affects ball placement and alignment. The positive thing about alignment is a lot of people have a tendency to set up with their shoulders open or closed. Well, the great part of the M2M setup is it's everything's based on lining the joints up in neutral. If the joints are in neutral, you are not open or closed. So just the nature of every club you pull out of your bag, you get in the box, you no longer have to worry, oh, oh, I forgot, I gotta, you know, open my shoulders up or close them based on that. So again, mind emotion is historically getting rid of so many swing faults that you used to have to think about just all in the setup alone. So one of the things that changes um, that will be a big change for you is the ball placement with the M2M setup and I'm gonna show you why. Let's say that you're normally you set up and your shoulders are a little bit hunched and you're more upright and you have a lot of bend at the knee. All right, so I see this set up all the time and then they kind of do this and then bounce in the knee. So you can tell they're used to everything being out here. All right, so that would be my ball placement for this setup. So I'm gonna come down, try to come back through square from where I set up. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is go in the box. I'm gonna pull my abs in. I'm gonna take out a little knee bend and now I'm gonna shift back to my butt and my hips. That is literally three ball lengths closer to me. Now, the most important thing I want to tell you is totally understandable if your eye looks at that and says, I am never going to be able to hit the ball that close. But I want to assure you that you will hit the ball that close because I hear this all the time. And it does kind of throw you, but um, that's going to be part of it. If you get that new setup, there's no possible way that that ball can be that far away from you. So that's gonna be a real important part. And then back to the concept of alignment, my shoulders can't be open or closed. The box means shoulders, pelvis, hip, knee, ankle, everything's in alignment, it's in a straight line. So I'm here, I'm here, my ankle, my knees, the ball's in the right position. So if I'm lining up to target and I wanna make sure I'm lining up, when I look down, this left shoulder should not be up in here. So when you see a lot of people, they hike that left shoulder up. So what that does is it disconnects my box and now look at where my shoulders are. So now, just like putting, when I look down the line, I can draw a true railroad track down that line because my shoulder is in line with the rest of my body. So that is my true railroad track. So that's gonna help your alignment tremendously um, because we all know you can have the best swing in the world, but if you're not lined up right, it's still not gonna go where you wanna go. So applying those two principles, ball being closer, I know that's gonna be a little hard for your eye to adapt to. Trust me, you will end up hitting the ball. The positive side of applying this setup in the alignment right off the bat is you're gonna line up much better to your target. Hi, Allison here. Thanks for watching that clip. And if you enjoyed it and you're interested in scheduling your own one-on-one -on -one Zoom lesson, just click the link below. Thanks.